Hey guys, welcome to another video. My name is Antonio. Finally, the snow has melted so I can bring back the soccer content for you guys. I know it's been a while, but it was snowing. The ground is like mad soaked, like super wet. And that's why I wanted to bring you guys a review or first impressions of these champos that I just got. Check them out. We got the anti-clog champos right here. Look how beautiful they look. Wow, wow, wow. And just make sure to pause the screen and read that. It says, do not use abrasive cloths or brushes. So this is the anti-clog version of the Champos. Look at them, they look beautiful. Let me know down below. Are we liking this? Oof. Man, it's been so busy. I completely forgot to take off my glasses today. I usually wear contacts. I don't know what happened to me today, but we're rocking the glasses here. I feel like I'm a little kid or something because I, I, I forgot my contacts. How do I do that? Anyway, we got the anti-clog tampos right here. You guys can see on the box, we have the Legend 8 Elite SG Pro AC in seven and a half. This is my true size. Got Adidas socks. Don't hate me in the comments for wearing glasses and Adidas socks, but we'll just keep it a light session. You guys should tell the ground is super, super wet. These are gonna get really dirty, which is sad, but it's gonna be all right. Let's just do it. I know some of you guys are gonna be asking why would I want anti-clog cleats? Well, it's for days like this where it's been snowing or it's just either the fall or in the winter where we have really crazy conditions on the field that could be potentially dangerous when you're playing. For instance, take a look. Take a look at this field. It's super wet and moist. And you guys can just see, it can be really dangerous because when you're running and pivoting, if you, go ahead and pivot and your studs are full with dirt underneath then you're not going to get the best traction in the world which can cause different issues and come to injuries potentially because you can twist your ankle because you're pivoting and then you don't get that traction you needed so that's why it's really beneficial to have anti-clog cleats like this because it'll keep them protected from catching a lot of dirt underneath the studs and that way everything can stay super nice and clean now obviously these are going to get super dirty which kind of sucks but hey i really wanted some anti-clogs because it rains in the winter a lot in the fall and then you get fields like this that i love i'm definitely fortunate to have goals and everything but of course i want to be able to be safe when i'm out here
We did stairs there. Really nice and simple. I haven't played soccer in like two months. No joke. Because I had an adductor injury. Really sucked. Recovering from that. I also had a little bit of IT band syndrome. I guess getting older really does suck. And obviously that has snowed a couple times here. And so I haven't been able to get out here. But with the ground being so wet, you guys can tell that the anti-clog is definitely doing a good job. I'm able to pivot while I'm doing the ladders. I don't feel like I need to clean off my studs because of lack of traction. You guys definitely can see that there is dirt building up under the soles, but the studs are very clear of crazy buildup of dirt, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and do some juggling and then I'll come back to you guys with some more input on that, okay? All right, let's do it. It's crazy how <laughs> you don't touch the soccer ball for about two months because of injuries and then just weather and you gotta just love it. I, I can barely juggle, um, but we'll be back. We just gotta stay positive. It's okay. Injuries happen and it's part of life, so we move on. Juggling, of course, in the Champo 9s is always fantastic. You get this really plush feeling, obviously, with the leather and sadly the new champo 10s do not have leather so that really sucks but i love the champo 9s because they have that plush pillowy feeling and obviously if you guys want to check out a full review make sure to check it out down below in the description box or up in the cards area i believe it's here in the cards area check it out because i have the champo 9 review in this like awesome pinkish salmon colorway and I'm just gonna go ahead and set up some cones so we can start pivoting a little bit. I'm still gonna take it very easily because I'm still recovering from that adductor strain that I had. It was horrible, had me out for two months. Enough of me talking, let's set up those cones and dribble a little bit, let's go. Feels so good to finally be out here. The weather somehow, you know, at the end of January should be freezing cold still, but it's so nice out here. 
I read on the weather that it's 57 degrees. I just checked it, believe it, craziness. I'm gonna call it here, I don't wanna overdo it because I'm still recovering from an injury. But as you guys can tell, the anti-clog is definitely holding up. I have really good feedback when I'm pushing down on the ground, when I'm pivoting. And that's super exciting because although I love the Champos 9s, awesome cleats, but the stud length isn't very long. You guys will definitely take a look at like cleats like Adidas, even sometimes some Puma cleats, and their stud length is very long. So it makes it really ideal for grass, especially if it's still wet because the studs are just that much longer, which is awesome. So if you guys want a little bit of both where you can play in dirt and also on grass safely, then I would definitely take a look at some Adidas cleats, especially like Predators that have really aggressive traction. So definitely take a look at those. It'll give a little bit of both worlds there, but could be kind of dangerous for artificial uh, grass, so like turf. But nonetheless, these are doing the job. I remember with the Champo 9s that are just for like any surface, you know, just the regular ones. I was definitely slipping a lot when it was like these type of conditions. It was super frustrating. I almost got injured just like four months ago because of that same exact scenario. That's why I got these anti-clogs. I'm loving them so far. I'll be back tomorrow or the following day with some more, you know, detailed uh, feedback and more reviews on everything. I just really, I'm wearing my glasses, unfortunately. So it gets a little foggy, but I appreciate you guys so much. Thanks again. Make sure to hit like, subscribe, comment down below. Appreciate you guys. Love you. Thanks.